And don't forget, if you enjoy our videos, to like, share and subscribe to our channel for great wildlife content. There's nothing cuter than cute little puppies. Cute little puppies. Cute little puppies. Everybody loves these cute little puppies. Yeah. Cute little puppies. Cute Just notice. No caption. No hashtags. Wanna know why? Because we don't need them. We got one of the biggest forces in the world. The, the boys. boys. See all these girls out here making dumb videos. Trying to act all cute and stuff. Bro, I might pull a flexing on these niggas like a rose. Hey, look. It's a comment. Well, thank you, Nick Blandon, for the comment. Today, I'm going to try and explain this comment as simple, as quick as possible. All right. With rhinos... General obvious that you're going to be looking for, and you've got to get quite close, is the male parts that make a male a male, and the female parts that make a female a female. Right, sometimes it's not that easy because they are located in the same area. Females have got two teats between the back legs, just below the belly, and males have a penile sheath between the back legs, just below the belly. So if it has one appendage, one straight solid appendage, it's a male. If it has two, it's a female. There are a few things in terms of behavior that we could go through, but there's not enough time in this video at the moment. But I'll leave you with this. What do you get if you mix an elephant with a rhino? Like for part two.